Space has become an important element in a country's economy and military superiority. Capability to defend against the space-based threats is a necessity. Mission Shakti is a major breakthrough in demonstrating the country's advancing technological capability of engaging satellites of low Earth orbit. The seeds for the ASAT test were sown back in 2014 when Prime Minister asked DRDO to work on challenging technologies. The National Security Advisor then held a series of discussions with DRDO on the subject and the final go-ahead for the test was given by the Prime Minister in 2016. The objective was to neutralize a satellite in orbit while ensuring the safety of other space assets. It was imperative that the test be done at the lower orbits which posed a serious challenge of highest speeds. A multi-stage interceptor missile with a hit-to-kill capable kill vehicle was configured with advanced technologies to handle closing speeds of more than 10 kilometers per second. A long-range strapped-down IIR seeker with hit-to-kill guidance and control, ring laser gyro-based navigation system and precision divert and attitude control system with quick reaction valves made the technological feat possible. The highest level of classification warranted the execution of the task in the shortest possible time. While only a small group knew what it was really about, the work was done by many teams across the labs. Nearly 150 scientists worked round the clock. The system was realized, integrated and brought to the flight test stage in a record time of two years. Many industries were engaged for the realization of components and systems in a concurrent mode, demonstrating maturity of Indian industry contributing to complex missions. Extensive hardware in the loop simulation tests were conducted to fine-tune and validate the design under all possible dynamic conditions to achieve the required accuracies. Meanwhile, a satellite was launched in an orbit under 300 kilometers to serve as a target for the mission in January 2019. The systems of BMD like radars, data links, communication network and ground systems were deployed over a wide geographical area for the mission. The weapon system detected, tracked and classified the target as a satellite to be engaged. The ground guidance system computed the exact launch time and the missile was launched at 11.09 hours on 27th March 2019. The booster stages had taken the missile to the required heights and velocities before the kill vehicle was released. The heat shield was ejected subsequently and the IIR seeker locked onto the target at the expected range. The terminal guidance executed the small and precise corrections to the part of the kill vehicle and the target was hit at the intended aim point with intense centimeter accuracy. The intercept occurred at 283 km height in a hit-to-kill mode. The radars and electro-optical systems captured the interception and the onboard IIR seeker's last image also confirmed the same. The Honorable Prime Minister has congratulated the scientific community. Jehind.